All right, and we're back. This time, Timothy and I unfortunately got tossed into another dimension, which was known as the Skulk Dimension. The place looks very interesting, but we don't want to stay here. But here's the thing, we can't get back home unless we go back to that portal, but there is absolutely no way that we can take on that Primal Warden as we are. The only chance I have in that fight is if I obtain the Sacred Warden armor, and that's not easy to get. So Timothy and I will be spending the next 100 days surviving in the Skulk Dimension. Oh, this should be fun. And if you enjoy the video, please consider subscribing because it really helps out the channel and it allows us to continue making videos just like this. All right, moving on. What did I just walk into? Where are the trees? Are there trees? How am I supposed to get materials? Are there even materials? Does food even exist here? Do I exist? Okay, what's going on? Well, all I can do at this point is wander around and hope I stumble across something. Hopefully I do, or I'm not gonna last too long here. Timothy, what a weird place. What is this? I don't understand. Skulk seeds? Okay, well, I'm gonna have to keep those. It's only one, but... I'm assuming it's food. Oh man, I can't get over there. Is there a way around here? All right, so I'm in this weird dimension and I have one lone seed in my pocket. I have no idea what it's for. I'm assuming food, but I could be wrong. How do I get down? What? Why am I up so high? Okay, let's go this way. This looks like a better way. I can't bridge over. I don't have the ability to get blocks. I need to find wood, but this place doesn't look like it has wood. Like, at all. What do you think, Timothy? We, uh, we messed up this time? We go the wrong place? I feel like it. I feel like it. You, you keep look out for wood, okay? Like a tree, anything. Like a log, even if it's just sitting on the ground. We need, we need to build wooden tools. Oh my gosh, where are we? I don't see any mobs, so that's kind of good. Oh, silly me. There are mobs in this place, and they are not messing around. What I didn't know at the time was these mobs were dangerous, and they hit hard. So it was best that I find material soon, or I'm not going to last long. Okay, considering I don't have food, I have to make sure that I just walk. That is it. No running, no jumping, any of that stuff. Oh my gosh, where am I going to go from here? Timothy, buddy. There's no way around. Okay, over here, maybe. I'm so high up. Why am I so high up? It's so vertical. How am I supposed to transverse it? And vertical it was. Usually verticality isn't that big of a deal, but it's a really big deal when you got nothing on and one wrong step and it's all over for me. Not just that, I couldn't take shortcuts. I had to make sure there was a way around or a safe way down because again, I have no food. So if I'm not careful, I just be picking away at my health to where I can't regenerate it. I gotta find some food and I gotta find it soon. It's not like I can go over there anyway. Getting down seems to be the biggest problem right now. I don't wanna... Oh, jeez. Okay, looks like I'm gonna take this way down. I'm assuming this goes all the way? Okay. Oh, that was too quick. That was too quick. And I lost a heart because of it. Great. Awesome. Perfect. Half a heart. Oh no, look! I got it back. I got it back. Okay, good. This is gonna take a while. Perfect. We did it, Timothy. We just took pretty much all day. Wait, is that water? We literally could have just jumped in water. <laughs> Why? Uh, okay. Looks like I'm still going to look for uh, food or wood. I don't know. Ooh, what's over there? Is that bone? Okay, so there's bone. That's good. But there's a lot of phantoms over there and they look like centipedes or something. Snakes? They look like snakes. Oh no, look, they got, they're centipedes, they got feet. Oh man. Okay, so things are starting to look up a little, and I stress the word little. This biome has bone in it, and I was tempted to go over and grab some, because I had a feeling I was gonna need it later. But here's the thing, I have no tools to even get the bone materials. And if I did, it wouldn't matter, because I have no armor and no weapons, and I can't take the chance of just wandering in there, hoping I'll find a tree so I can make tools, because there's no trees around where I'm at, and there's probably a good chance that there's none in there either. So for now, I'm gonna have to scout the place out first, to see what this biome has to offer. All right, let's take your time. It's the phantoms I'm worried about. I, I have no idea what these guys do. They hurt or not. Don't aggro on me. Oh, 
nope, 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 nope. Can't do it. Can't do it. Timothy, we're in trouble, buddy. What are we gonna do? Hide? Okay, we're gonna hide in a block. Sounds good. So as far as I know, there isn't any wood or trees in this biome. I mean, I didn't really get a close look, but I can't risk moving in closer due to phantoms. There is these centipede things too, and who knows what else. So for now, I just gotta keep moving until I find a different biome, if there is a different biome. Timothy and I kept moving through this vast area. I feel like I was trying to cross the barren desert with no supplies. All I know is I need to find something soon. I'm at a loss. I don't, I don't know what to do. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, it's right there. I can't, I can't, wait, is that ore? Is that ore? Timothy, okay, we can get weapons, we can get tools, but I need to find wood. I have no idea if this place has wood. I can't take the risk getting the bone, I just can't. I mean, there's no point getting bone if I can't even plant it. I don't think the seed can plant in this stuff, can it? Nope, what about, what about this? Looks like deep slate, okay. Just keep moving along, I guess. Come on, buddy. No? Okay, you find another way down, okay? You're scared to jump. It's all right, though. It's it's actually pretty pleasant. You, you can do it. I got faith in you, buddy. Oh, okay. Wow, that was quite a jump. Okay, if there's water here, there has to be some form of life, right? In that area over there, there's phantoms and centipedes, which is freaky enough as it is. There's like nothing here. Is there supposed to be something? Did you see any wood, buddy? I'm not seeing anything. At this point, I was feeling pretty hopeless. I've been walking around for a while and I have not come across anything of importance. Aside from those bones I found a little while back, which I couldn't even get to if I wanted to. Because a good couple hits from these fellows and it would be all over for me. Wait, those lights, they're not up here. So maybe, maybe that's a different biome? Maybe? Oh, there's sensors over there too. I see the bone again. I don't see trees though. Those vines. I see those vines. They have phantoms over there getting jiggy with it. Oh man. I can't. I just can't go in there yet. I mean, I want the bone, but I can't do it. I don't know, buddy. I don't know what to do. I don't want to be swimming. That takes more hunger too. Oh, man. Three hunger bars down. That's awesome. Great. That's right, day two and three hunger bars down already. I literally only could walk around as it was less expensive on the hunger. If I was running around the whole time, I'd probably be starving by now. I really need to find some food or at least find some dirt so I can plant these seeds. But then again, I gotta find wood to make a hoe so I can plow the dirt so I can plant the seeds. I can't win. It's been forever. I need to find something or I'm not gonna last. I don't even know if there is wood, but since there's ore, there's got to be wood, right? There's got to be wood somewhere. Gotta stop jumping. I gotta stop jumping. This is crazy, Timothy. Crazy, I tell ya. Coming? Alright, good. Oh, please tell me there's a way around this. I don't think so. Wait, does this go in? How far does that go in? Is that... I don't want to dig. Tire myself out. Oh my gosh, Timothy. You know what, Timothy? We could be we could be going around in circles, and I have no idea. I really don't. Everything looks the same. Everything looks the same. Okay, I gotta jump here. Ugh! That was scary. That was scary, buddy. You got it. Come on. Ooh, bones. Yes. Maybe I'll get lucky, and there won't be any phantoms around. But that's probably not going to be the case at all. Nope. Phantoms right there. Can I get by? I just want to get by. Don't even want to be. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. No, 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 oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 oh no, gosh, gosh, oh no, oh, whoa, 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 what, what just happened, what just happened, run, Timothy, run, oh my gosh, I'm gonna die, this is it, this is it, why did I do that? Well, at least I know what these things do now. I was so focused on the phantoms that I didn't realize they were there. Although they probably are things that I don't want to step on too often, but they definitely helped me escape. I really shouldn't have tried to go for the bone because it just wasn't worth it. And now I'm low in health. I have no way to get it back. I got to be more careful than this. I really do. Is he gone? Looks like he's stuck, but I don't know where to go. Oh, no. Okay, well, he's being stuck up there. Can we... At least sneak by him. Nope. 
Is there water? Better take a chance. Oh, now get away. Run and don't look back. That was a big mistake. That was a huge mistake. Three and a half hearts, buddy. That's all we got. That's all I got. All right, day three. I'm feeling like things are gonna go my way today. Just trying to stay positive, okay? Cool. Oh, careful there, Timothy. There's a hole. That's why I don't like being up high. That way? This way? No, I can't go that way. Yeah, maybe I'll go in here. Try this out, maybe. Whoa. Are those leaves? If those are leaves, that means that's a tree. I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope. Are there phantoms around? I hope not. <gasps> what is that thing? What is that thing? Oh my gosh, it's wood. But what is that thing? Finally, about time. I can finally build some tools and weapons now. Awesome. And it only took multiple days to find the wood, which is weird because normally you get wood in the first couple minutes of a fresh playthrough, not a whole two days later. It's crazy. Okay, so these things, they are known as the Shattered. Why? I couldn't tell you. But it's probably because of how beaten up they look. Either way, these guys will sense you if you set off a sensor. Just like the Warden. And they hit really hard. Like, they really do. Gonna have to keep my distance for a while, for sure. Is anybody around the wood? Maybe I can sneak up on it. Alright, I don't see anybody. Let's go. Oh! Okay, he's pretty far away and I don't think he notices me. Let's do it. Let's do it quick. Just do it quick. Don't worry about it. Don't mind me, just getting wood. I can't believe this is happening. Uh, you know what? Maybe they're just not that smart. Okay, let's go back over here, Timothy. Let's do this. Oh yes, it's wood, it's actual wood. Finally, finally, on day three, I was finally able to make some tools, which is crazy to think because tools are normally something you craft within the first few minutes of a new world, but I'm not out of the woods yet or, or the forest. No, it's, it's the woods. Maybe? Whatever, it doesn't matter. I still need to find dirt. And if there are trees, there should be dirt, right? Well, I hope. Now there's gotta be stone around here. Is this considered stone? Oh, cobbled gloomstone, okay. That's stone. Where'd it go? Oh, Timothy, don't take my stuff, man. Oh no, no, he's right there. Come on. Okay, I got a tool, which is nice, but it doesn't help me any, because I got no dirt. Is any of that dirt? You know what? I'm gonna go around and take a look up here. I could be just looking in the wrong spot. Why is there so many sensors? Annoying. Oh, that's iron. Is this dirt? No, it's still stone. Shoot. Are these for anything? No, just vines, I guess. All right, let's get this iron. Yes. All right, all right, all right. I got one iron. Let's run. Run, Timothy. Is anyone coming for us? Nope. There's gotta be dirt around here somewhere. I mean, the tree grew. It, it must have grew in something, right? No, it's just the skulk stuff. Okay, well, I gotta get this wood anyway. Oh, oh, I think we're caught. I think we're caught. Yeah, yeah, we're definitely caught. He's coming, slowly, but he's coming. Run, Timothy, run. Oh, he's still coming. He's still coming. What are we gonna do? I better get some more blocks. Just, uh, just, uh, keep an eye out, Timothy, okay? Oh no, he's coming. He's coming, Timothy. He's coming slow, but he's coming. It's like a slow speed chase here. It's kind of different. All right, let's get rid of this guy. Oh my gosh, where is he? Where'd he go? Oh, you got one of those, did you? Yeah, those are fun. Unless I'm in them. Come on, Timothy, get in, come on. No, Timothy, get in. I can't put the block down. You're gonna get me killed, buddy. Where'd he go? Where's he at? Oh, 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 never mind, he's there. Come on, Timothy, come on! No, Timothy! Okay, I gotta I gotta leave you over here. You're gonna you're gonna get me killed, buddy. There, stay right there, okay? Come here, you! I got a little surprise for you. Come on. Come on! Come on over! Don't be shy. There we go. Come on in. Actually, no, don't don't come in. Just stand there. So I can hit you. There we go. There we go. No, no, come back here! Over here! There. Um, closer. I need you closer. Come on! Oh my gosh, why don't you listen to me? Okay, so these guys are really scaring me because they take a lot of hits. Oh my gosh, finally. What'd you drop? Oh, soul dust, okay, cool. Whatever that is. Timothy, I'm gonna leave you over here, buddy, okay? It's kind of dangerous. Okay, where's the dirt? There's gotta be dirt. Wait, 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 wait. That purple stuff, what is that? Oh, there's a shattered right there. But I, I should be fine, right? Oh, please, please let this be dirt. Okay, I gotta check it over here. I don't want to get hit. 
All right, all right, all right, all right. I'm leaving, I'm leaving. Timothy, I think I got dirt. Well, I hope it's dirt. Echo soil, that's dirt, right? It's gotta be dirt. This is good, this is good. Oh, great. I got two of them now. Timothy, there's two of them. Actually, you know what? I'm leaving, okay? You guys can keep the place, all right? I just gotta get something planted. I gotta get food going here, and I need that water. All right, how am I gonna get down here? Oh, don't push me off, Timothy. Oh, wait, wait, it's just water, let's go. Sweet. Oh, seriously? You guys followed me this far? Actually, I didn't really go that far. Oh, you're going for a ride too, eh? How you like that? Oh my gosh, there's two of them. Great. Okay, um, yeah, we can't do this here, Timothy. You know what? No, no, I'm done running. I'm gonna take him out. I'm gonna take him out. I'm not leaving, you're leaving. Can't touch me, can ya? Not so tough now, eh? There. Nothing but a bunch of bullies. Oh, let's go over there. Looks like a good spot. I'm gonna finally get some food going. Kinda looks like a good spot to set up, you know? Okay, are you ready, Timothy? Okay, first things first, let's get me some food here. Uh, I don't have a hoe. I don't have my crafting table either. I must have left it up there. Doesn't surprise me, but... What's that supposed to mean? Okay, here we go. Oh, I can. I can plow it. Nice. Why can't I put anything in it? Oh, I don't have a light level. Okay, that's not good. I need coal. This is not good. Really? Just when things were getting better. Of course this had to happen. All right, I gotta look for some coal, I guess. Or maybe I can borrow a light source. You think these guys would mind? Probably, but I, I don't really have an option. You know, Timothy, um, we're gonna have to go back up. The trees have a light source. The only thing is, I have no idea. No idea if I'm gonna be able to get underneath it. So let's get some stone so that I can uh, build something around it at least. I'm gonna have to sit there for literally a couple days because I am almost out of chicken wings. Or are they ham legs? Oh, I mean, I mean chicken wings for sure. Yeah, chicken wings. All right, I gotta make a safe way up and down because I can't lose any more hearts. I really can't. All right, uh, done. Perfect, look at that. Where'd my crafting table go? Thought I made one. It's right there. Okay, buddy, you stay here. Okay, I'm gonna do something very dangerous. This is the most tense I've ever been making a pickaxe. <laughs> yeah. Okay, it doesn't seem like anybody's here. What? Why? Why isn't this not working? I don't understand. Shh, shh. Shut it. Maybe here. Yes, okay. Okay, we gotta plant it. We got it planted. That's good. Now I'm gonna build around this tree. It's gonna be my tree, nobody else's. All right, I don't know why I'm whispering, but okay. And that's what I did. I took some time to build myself a base around my crop. Now granted, I didn't plan out this build at all. I just needed four walls and a roof. That was all. There, looks good. Not really. Nah, it looks good. Who are we kidding? It's ugly. It's okay, it will survive. Okay, so I was still scared that these guys were gonna spawn in my house. I don't know what triggers them to spawn. They either spawn because of this stuff, or these things, or maybe even the light source. But either way, I wanted to be safe, you know? Yeah. There, we got a base now, Timothy. How do you like it? Okay, buddy. I need you to watch the place because I gotta go get some iron so we can get some water, okay? I gotta make a bucket. Because if I don't get water, that crop is gonna grow very slowly and we don't got time for that. All right, there we go. Only took like five days to get a little base built. Awesome. Only thing left now is to get these things. Sorry, I mean this crop growing. I sure hope it grows quick because I'm running out of time. Look at my hunger. All right, buddy, I gotta go. I gotta get some more iron so we can get some water in here. This is taking a while to, to happen. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, so it seems like the ores are in this green stuff. Shh, quiet. You don't need to be so noisy, okay? Let's take care of these things. I don't like these things. Spreading their skulk finds everywhere. I actually don't even know what they do. Oh, nice. Oh, there's some right there too. Nice. One, two, good, good. Oh. Oh, there's more. And there's more of them. Like a lot of them. Why is this... Okay, let's, uh, it's the best way to, oh, look, some more. No, no. 
Well, that's gone. Let's get down. Shh, quiet. Don't be so noisy all the time. Okay. Let's get this smelted. Uh, really? <laughs> Why is there six of you on my roof? What is this? Did Timothy throw a party while I was gone? But seriously, why are there six of them? I hope they're only on the outside or I'm in trouble. It's gonna be risky. I'm running in. I'm gonna try to run in. Oh no. Woo! Oh my gosh. This really needs to stop happening. I'm draining my hunger just from taking them out. Now, why are these guys spawning? I bet you it's because of these things. Catalysts, I don't know, maybe? Possibly what's causing it. Like I mentioned before, I'm not sure why these shattered dudes keep spawning. It could be because of the catalyst or the light. So I figured I'd do a process of elimination and clear out the catalyst first to see if that helps. After I got those all cleared out, it was finally time for me to get some water. I need to get that crop to grow. Why is it taking so long? Oh, there's my crafting table. Wonder where I put that. Doesn't really surprise me. So far, so good. I'm gonna make an infinite source here. Oh my gosh, I've got one hunger left. This is literally the last thing I can do and then I'm done. I have to literally just sit there and wait. There, we're good. Timothy, I think we're good. Why is that not soaking up? Getting moist. Once the block of dirt soaked in water, I literally sat in the same spot for four days until I had enough crops for a piece of food because I was literally on my last hunger bar. I legit couldn't move unless I wanted to starve to death. Riveting content, I tell ya. But I really had no choice. Looks like they're fully grown. They better be. Seven, okay, good. Skulk grass, that's interesting. It looks like wheat. Let me guess. Oh, uh, oh that doesn't look like bread. Skulk grass loaf. Okay, I mean, sure. Look at that. Look at that. Things were starting to get a little better. I got some food and I replanted what I could. But while I was staring at the crops, I didn't realize that the shattered ones were starting to surround my base. This was not good, so I had to clear them out. I don't understand, where are these guys coming from? Okay, so obviously I'm missing something. These shattered are still spawning. And I basically got rid of all those catalysts, so it's gotta be something else. Could be this vine stuff, or maybe it's the lights. Either way, I needed to figure this out. If I plan on surviving, because I don't need to be caught off guard. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Thank you. That's very nice of you. Very nice. What is this? What is this? Is this what I think it is? Is this what I think it is? Oh my gosh, it is. Oh my gosh, it's coal. Getting this place cleaned up, look at that. Okay, it's definitely the light because they spawn on top. All right, so it must have been the light because I mean they were literally spawning on top of my base, right next to the lights. Unless of course they were attracted to it, but who knows. I spent most of day 12 just clearing out the shattered again and then worked on gathering materials to cover the base with. It's not going to be fun working without lights. I can get away with having light in my base because I spawn proofed the area, but it's going to be more interesting outside my base. Well, this is going to be interesting. The next couple of days, I spent some time searching and mining some more iron so I could finally get some armor on my body, which is absolutely insane if you think about it, that it took me 13 days before I could put iron on. But again, iron wasn't my main concern at first. Food was and it still is a concern because well it takes forever to grow it's horrible anyway all right so it was day 15 and i was down three hearts but other than that everything seemed like it was going okay got some armor crops were growing and my base was safe from mobs or at least i thought it was what, what the heck what is that oh my gosh what is that what is that Why is that a thing? Oh! Go away. You're not wanted. Get. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, is this still coming? They are still coming. Oh! running. I'm not using light anymore. No way.
Go. Oh. Nope. No, I can't fight them. I can't fight them. I can't do it. Can I lose them at least? What just happened? I literally almost died. My heart is pumping so hard right now. Like, where did they come from? What caused them to spawn? I just got rid of the shattered. Now I gotta deal with these things? Come on. Oh my gosh. That was scary. You guys can stay over there. Oh, wow. Okay, um, don't. Don't put light down. I would test it to see if these guys came from this biome, but right now I just can't. I got one heart. One heart. One wrong move and it's all over for me. I don't know what to do. I can't go out. I'm not taking the chance. I could fall. It'd be over. Am I going to sit here and wait for these again? I think so. I think that's what I'm going to do. I have to. Oi. Anyway, with all that dealt with, I just had to sit here for the next couple days and stare at the crops. Trust me, I don't make a habit out of this, but it's absolutely necessary for me to do it right now. By day 18, I was able to harvest a couple crops. Not sure why the others are taking their sweet time to grow, but either way, I was able to get myself fed and gain back some hearts. So there was that. Not really having the ability to go out and do anything risky, I thought my time would be better spent expanding my farm. If you want to call it a farm. But sure. So day 19 wasn't so lively at first. I was getting the farm expanded, but really there wasn't much to do until I had a constant storage of food. But y'all know me, I get bored and I enjoy putting myself in risky situations. And I figured since these were the first patch of trees I've seen for days, I better cut them down for wood because I'm gonna need it. And who knows, who knows when I'm gonna find more trees. Some more of those trees, maybe. Biggest thing is just taking out the light. If I can take out the light, I think I'm good. Okay. Oh, I just ticked everybody off. Not good. Where are you guys at? Come on. Gosh, they are all coming. Come on. Let's see if my trap works. Come on in. All right, everybody line up. Okay, that was a lot. Um. After eliminating those fellas, it became very apparent that if I want that wood over in that area, I'm gonna need to clear out the lights, which is not gonna be easy, especially if I got this many spawning. Like I mentioned before, these guys hit hard, so I definitely wouldn't survive more than two hits. But I had an idea. Let's just hope it works. So is there an easier way to do this maybe? There we go. Get rid of all this light. Who needs this light anyway? Not me. Yeah, that was not worth it. That was not worth it. They are awfully close to me. And there's awfully a lot of them. I just can't fall. Do not fall. Do not fall. Okay, I think that's a win on my part. They're not following me because they can't get up to me. Oh, I don't know where I'm at. Uh, I know, I know where I'm at. I'm just gonna have to dig through. Get me out of here. Okay, I would say that was pretty successful. I didn't get all the lights, but I got most of them. Or not even most of them, I got some of them. All right, it is definitely lights, cause look, they're not even close to my place. None have spawned there. And I don't even think they're coming over, are they? Oh, well, they're looking for me. Oh man, this food situation is not it. <sighs> not it at all. Okay, so the next day I got started working on my plan to harvest all the wood in the area. I was gonna try and make my way on the rooftops of the trees and hopefully break all the lights that way. But just in case I fell or the shattered spawned on the trees, I needed a place to eliminate the horde because of the situation I got myself into the previous day. But I needed some type of trap that could do all the killing for me because for one, it took all day just to eliminate a big group of these guys and two, save myself the hunger because I'm still running into issues of not having enough food. So I got started with building a trap and incorporated these magma things because it would do the elimination for me just from the fall damage alone. Well, that was the plan anyway. All right, trap was completed, I think, or the first rendition, I guess. Time to test it out. Okay, go over here. What did he, did he go in my thing? Why are you going in my trap? I'm not even in there yet. Okay, now you can come up, come on up now. Let's go. Come on. Oh. Okay, stay in there. It's it's semi-working. I mean, it's alright. 
I just want them to keep going up and down so I don't have to hate hitting them. Not that efficient, but it was wor it's working. Come on, you. Come on up. Let's go. Oh! He hit me. Is it working? Oh, he can't get back! It's working! He hit me, but it's working! I just gotta sit here and wait. Because they have crazy amounts of life. Oh, look at that! Okay. Cool. That works. With my trap set and my crops growing, I was all set to work on removing the lights off those trees. Let's get it done. Timothy, I'm gonna go and do that whole light thing again. I mean, it's ugly, but it works, right? That, that's all that matters. Don't worry about me, guys. Just keeping the environment healthy from shattered. That's it. That's all of them here. Because I'm not looking around for wood again. I, I'm sorry, I, I gotta get this place cleared out. All these guys are making me nervous. All right, let's go back. Call that a win in my books. Oh, here they come. Here they come. Come on over, guys. Ow! I gotta get down there sooner. No! Okay, this trap sucks. <laughs> oh. It works once they're in. How many are still around here? Oh, there's still quite a few. And he's just, you know, chilling. Wait till he dies and then I'm running to the house. <laughs> I'll fix this. I gotta figure something else. This is not gonna work like that. No! Oh, no! He... That's what I was worried about. Getting hit through the walls. They're all right there. They're all right there. They're all right there. Ah! Oh, 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 my gosh. Oh, my gosh. No, no. No, 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 Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my, oh my gosh, I can't believe that. Ugh. No! No! <laughs> okay, well, that didn't work out as well as I planned. I got stuck in my own trap. It doesn't surprise me, to be honest with you. Maybe I should abandon that idea entirely. Definitely too risky. So for the next couple days, I figured I would play it safe and get this farm expanded and broke this embarrassment down. Oh my gosh, I can't wait until food doesn't become an issue anymore. It really makes it tough to do anything. Wait. Wait, oh, oh, oh. Get out of my house or my base. How'd you get in there? I thought I spawn proof that. This is why I need a trap. I'm always depleting my hunger because I gotta whack these guys about a hundred times each. I don't know, maybe I'll make a simpler trap. Gosh, how'd you get in here? Me being as stubborn as I am, I decided to build a simpler trap because I was still dealing with a lot of shatter. Is it going to work? I have no idea, but I'm sure I'm gonna find out. Pretty bad though, like I have to make a maze just to get down here to get all these lights out because I want the wood. Okay, how many more trees? Two, three, three more trees. Oh my gosh, look at them all down there. Oh my gosh. I'd be dead in a second if I was down there. Easily. Just a horde of them coming. Run! Come on, you! Let's go, guys! This way! It's actually not that bad. They're kind of slow. What? Where did he go? This seems like a way better trap. Come on, guys. Keep on the coming. You's got it. Come on in. Don't tell me they don't like water. Okay, this is working a lot better anyway. Stop hitting me. Okay, I can't, I can't, they keep hitting me. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of them. Yeah, so this trap is garbage. I'm pretty much stuck in here until they're all dead, which is not what I wanted. But since the echoing forest or whatever this place is called, is pretty much clear of lights. I figured I probably wouldn't need this trap anymore anyway. So I spent a good amount of time harvesting the wood from these trees, which I felt pretty good about because I have no idea if I'll come across any more trees anytime soon. But since I removed all the lights, I was worried that I was gonna get random shatters spawning in my base. So I built a little spawn trap so they would have a place to spawn but it would keep them away from me. And in the process, feed these things. I don't know what it is. Don't ask me. I have no idea. I just know if you fall into it, you're dead. All right? All right. 
So, I harvested all that wood, I have a full set of iron armor, all I needed now was a good amount of food. You know, eat until my hunger is full. But crops for some reason don't grow quickly here. So on day 30, I set out to look for another biome that contained bones in it. If the crops are gonna be this stubborn, I might as well go out and get some bone meal. You know, move this thing along. I was starting to understand why the bone blocks are only in this biome. Because it's filled with annoying mobs. And let's face it, I'm horrible at hitting phantoms. So that's fun. Oh my gosh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where'd that come from? Get out of here. Oh my gosh. Get. Hate those things. They just come out of nowhere. Get them, Timothy. Hey, stop hitting me. I hate phantoms. I hate this biome. Okay, good. There. You want some too? Let's do it. Okay, I gotta get bone. I gotta go back. I'm done with this. Oh. What in the world is that thing? What? Timothy? Oh my gosh, he's looking at me. It's staring me down. What is it? What in the world was that thing? It looked like a giant worm. Like what? Maybe it's one of those ground things that decided to poke its head out or whatever, you know? Maybe it's not hungry anymore. I don't know. I wasn't going to mess with it. Not right now. My sole mission was to collect the bone blocks so I can get some bone meal and accelerate my crop operation. Once I obtained what I needed, it was time to head back. You know, get that farming done. Get me some food. I'm kind of scared for that, whatever that worm was. What is that guy? Oh. Listen. There. Well, since I'm right here, I might as well grab it. Ah. Be nice. Ow. Ooh, you bugger. You got me when I wasn't looking. Oh my god. <laughs> Thank you. I'm having a hard time hitting these things. Okay, uh, let's grab this. Huh? Wait a minute. It's one of those again. Why are these things spawning now? Who in the world are these guys? This biome was completely empty. Well, aside from these little guys. But you could avoid them if you didn't have a torch. But these zombie warden looking fellas spawn in the dark, which is great. I got mobs that spawn in the light and mobs that spawn in the dark. Awesome. Oh my gosh. Really? It's running. No, I don't like you. Oh, yes. Let me get him. What is that thing? Okay, there's more of them. There is more of them. Timothy, are we lost, buddy? I think we're lost, which is not good. I got all this bone. I can make bone meal, but we're lost. So that's great. And there's a bunch of these guys everywhere. Fun. Timothy, watch out. Uh, okay. They're not that tough. Still tough, but not that tough. Although I don't think they're dropping anything. What do you keep turning around for? Oh! Ah! Ah! Why? Why? <laughs> Where did you go? There was no light? Was there? As I was getting closer to my base on day 33, I noticed these guys everywhere and in every biome. You weren't safe, so I had to be careful. Once I finally returned to my base, you bet I used that bone meal and grew those crops. Are things really starting to go my way or are these guys gonna cause me grief? Who knows? So the next morning, or day, night, evening? I don't know, there's no sky here. So anyway, the next day I was raided by these guys. Okay buddy, you stay here. We're gonna go venture out and find a new spot and uh, I'll be back, okay? You make sure you take care of the, the place, okay? All right. Oh my gosh, look at y'all. Hey, no, no, get, get back. Oh no, uh, oh no, no, oh no, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Do I got this? I, I got this. Oh my gosh. Okay, these guys hit harder than I thought. Alright, let's clear them out. Oh! What am I doing? Oh my gosh. What am I doing? I was trying to clear the area and uh, I didn't keep a eye on my health. So, uh, yeah. That was my bad. Alright, let's get a boat made here. Wait. 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 What is this? Wet sculpt flesh? Is that coming off the new guys? What's it for? Okay, um, can I eat it? No. 
I'm so confused. So I must be able to do something with them. I was curious about this flesh. So I went out to hunt some more of these warden zombies so I could get more flesh. That was a short boat ride, but whatever. Oh my gosh, break already. <laughs> Did they not break? What is going on? Look at this thing. Oh my gosh, this can't be serious. I don't, I don't understand. They don't break, okay? Well, I tried. Okay, so they are coming from them. Good. I didn't realize I was getting them. Ah! I don't know what they're for. Once I collected what I thought was enough, I tried crafting with the flesh. I want to see this. What is this? What is this for? Wait, what was that? Stitched, skulk, damp, hide. Okay, what's that mean? <gasps> Can I make... I might be able to make leather. I might be able to make leather. I'm gonna make a furnace, because it's damp, right? So maybe I can cook it. <gasps> I can cook it. Leather! That's weird looking leather, but I got leather. Okay, okay, all right, okay, that's good. That's awesome. We can do that now. This was a game changer. Being able to get leather was nice because I still wanted to enchant. Some of these mobs did hit hard, so unenchanted gear is not the way to go. Only problem is, where do I find paper? On day 35, I figured it was time to move from this place, you know, find a new spot and get set up better. I have a good amount of food for a couple days trek, but I didn't want to get lost because there really isn't any recognizable structures or land masses. Everything looked the same, so I figured I would just go in one direction. I want to keep going straight. Once I start straying, then I start getting lost. But you know what? It's okay, maybe I'll find diamonds in here. I don't know. Aha! I'm through! More water! Yay! Sure, digging through a section sucked, but it was fine, because I will have an easier time finding my way back. The next day, I stumbled across this place, and it had a lot of bone blocks, so I figured this might be a good place to set up a permanent base. Okay, uh, this is the biome I want to build in. I know there's got a lot of stuff, but nothing spawns with the light, I don't think. The thing is, I gotta deal with these guys. Come here. Ow. Who, who's hitting me? These guys give me bones. I don't know what to do with the bones. I think this is where I'm going to build. Once I clear some of this place out, I get some lights around here. I think I'll look pretty good. Let's get some torches down. Don't mind me, guys. Just, uh... <gasps> nope. Not, not there. Not there. Not there. Not there. Not there. Not there. Chompers are coming in there. Not doing that. No way. I think I can make it work here. I think this is where we're going to be. Uh, Chompers. They're not supposed to spawn here, and they're spawning here. Well, that sucked. <laughs> ah! Scared me. I'm fighting three of them here. Do I want to build here? Yeah, I have to. I'm no There's no way I'm surviving. Okay, I think I'm going to build right in here. Alright, let's start clearing this place out. Oh. Chompers! I don't know why they're still here. They shouldn't be spawning. <sighs> um, can't build here because of those guys. These guys. They can go through any type of floor, I'm pretty sure. So, I'm out of luck on that. I don't know. The only place they don't spawn is in a grove. Get out of here. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's not good. Get out of the water. Well, this place is horrible. Mobs everywhere. Now, I know they don't hit hard, but these guys alone are annoying to deal with. And I don't want to deal with that. So, I'll just keep on searching. I mean, it's a decent biome, but it's just not for me. I guess there's too many mobs in here. Like, the phantoms, I think, will just get them annoying anyway. So, maybe, maybe let's not do that. Ow. What? Ow, gosh. Get out. Oh my gosh, you guys. What is that? Who is this guy? Where did he come from? He can't be that strong, right? Jeez, I, I don't know if I want to find out. What are those things? Like worms? Where, where, where'd he go? He's gone? Where'd he go? Oh, this is a boss. This is a boss. 
How big of a boss are we talking here? Ugh. Nope. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh my gosh, he's right there. I'm not ready to fight him yet. I'm in iron armor. I'm not even in diamond. Nothing's enchanted. You think I got a chance against that thing? Well, that's enough for me. Dude had all kinds of things crawling out of him. Not someone I think I want to mess with. So I carried on looking for a nice place to settle. That guy was crazy. The next day, I finally found another echoing force. And really, I think this is the place I'm going to have to settle for. Because those chopper dudes don't seem to spawn here. So I'm safe lighting up my base. But I also found this little floating area. So all I had to do was remove the lights and build a little base here. I should be safe from the shatter. Once I got everything set up, it was time to head back to get Timothy and transfer everything over. After a couple days, Timothy and myself finally made it to the spot and started to get things together. No, oh, come here. Get in here, would you? Let's drop all this off. Okay, let's see here. Okay, so cobbled. Yes, okay, that is, can make stuff with that too, good. What is that? Cornflakes? Wood chips. What do I need wood chips for? I noticed that I could obtain wood shavings, which I can then turn into pulp and then paper. So I can get paper. This is good, so good. If you put the log in a stone cutter, you get the shavings. And then if you combine those shavings with a water bottle, you can turn it into pulp. As breaking these would drop glass shards, which could be made into glass blocks. And after a little bit of drying in the smelter, bam, you got paper. Nice. So, I had paper, I had leather, all I needed now was obsidian and diamonds. I have no idea if I can even get diamonds here. I haven't come across any so far. For the next day, I decided to dig down as far as I could to search for diamonds. I'm not gonna lie, it got real weird down here. Like the color got all desaturated. It actually made it difficult to spot ores. But either way, I had to continue. For a little bit, I finally came across a few diamonds. Which was good, because I wasn't even sure if you could get diamonds here. After a couple days, I obtained enough diamonds to craft a pickaxe and a sword, and I had two left over for an enchanting table. The only thing left now to obtain is obsidian, which I have an idea where I might be able to get some. Don't go that way. No. No, thank you. Okay. These should drop lava. I mean, it, it makes sense, right? I hope. Uh, no, may maybe, maybe there's a chance to drop lava. Come on! Uh, okay, um... Okay, never mind. I guess I don't know how I'm gonna get obsidian. Just great. At this point, I was over these little thrown together shacks. It was definitely time to get an upgrade. So I felt like today was the day to start building myself a base I could be proud of. Block types were pretty limited in this dimension, specifically the gray and green. But that's okay, I can get this to work. So I spent the next several days breaking down my temporary shack, laying down the perimeter of my new build, flattening the area, and filling in the holes. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Really? Such a dummy. Oh my gosh. Seriously? Okay, just, just build up. How's that sound? Sound good? Well, that wasn't smart. By any means. If it wasn't me being a danger to myself, it was these guys. It was definitely annoying trying to build with these guys always breathing down my neck. But I made it work. Okay, so I really wanted to incorporate this tree in the build, so I decided to just leave it where it was. You know, have it as like a centerpiece to my entrance. Look kinda cool. Considering most of the base was going to be made of stone, I decided to go with the echo slabs for the floor, you know, to give more of a nice warm feeling to the house. Because, you know, having just stone kinda makes it all kinda cold-like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Once I had the bottom floor layout completed, it was time to start building the rest of the base. I decided to go with higher walls that were built with gloomstone bricks, and I added an outer trim made up of the green bricks, whatever they're called. Considering the walls were high, I thought it would be nice to add in some longer windows to really complement that aesthetic. I know, I know, there isn't a sun in this dimension, so I know the windows don't really serve much of a purpose, but I went with them anyway, I just, I thought they looked nice. Now that I think of it, I should probably switch gears here for a second to get some crops planted so you know they have time to grow while i'm building i don't i don't see why i'm not doing this already silly me 
All right, so the base's second floor was gonna be the same outline. So I figured I should use the second floor as a crop growing area. This way it's inside and away from, you know, these guys. So I'll be able to harvest and plant in peace, or at least I hope so. Once the farm was completed enough to my liking, I was able to continue working on the rest of the base. Things were getting a little tricky at this point because of the height of the walls. I had to make sure I was careful because I didn't need to fall off to my death. I mean, I'm sure I could survive it, but there's no point taking the risk. I decided to fully designate the second floor to farming. So once I got the outer wall completed, I was able to add more crops and storage. It was really coming together. Food was starting to become plenty. For the roof, I decided to go with a semi-open concept and continued that aesthetic of the larger windows. There was only one problem with having no sun and high ceilings. The crops in the center would have no light and I couldn't place lanterns right at the top because, well, it's too far away. So I needed to drop the lanterns lower. I could have just hung the lanterns down with iron chains, but instead I decided to go with some natural looking echo log. You know, bring some warmth to the second floor and to tie the house together. And to finish the look off, echo tree leaves were added to the larger part of the ceiling, as well as using those leaves to create some shrubbery for the area, you know? Overall, I was pretty happy with the outcome. Day 65 was pretty laid back. The base was practically finished and the crops needed tending to. I'm gonna have so much food. This loaf is not really um great for, um. I don't know, eating. It, I mean, it's fine. Well, hello. What are you doing out there? Get a good look at you. So you're like, I don't know, all weird looking. Are you like a science experiment or I don't know. You look kind of like a zombie or something. Maybe. Go through uh, seeds pretty quick, eh, buddy? Hey, Timothy. We're farmers. We're farming in the deep, darker dimension. How do you like that? Yeah, I thought so. All right, if I plan on leaving this dimension, like I mentioned before, I need to defeat and take down that primal warden. But in order to face off with that dude, I need that sacred warden armor, which requires diamonds and netherite. But for now, since I know I could obtain diamonds here, I decided to get to work. And that's what I did for the next couple days. I went mining for those diamonds. So I still wanted to craft an enchanting table because I wanted to enchant, of course, you know, my gear to increase my odds of winning against that primal warden. But I had one problem. I had no idea where to get obsidian. But I do remember that this dimension does contain structures that can be looted. So it could be possible to contain obsidian blocks that way. Or maybe they have lava flowing inside them. Who knows? Only thing is, these structures are kind of rare. So it's gonna take some exploring. So that's what I did for the next couple days. Exploring the area and whacking these mobs because, well, they tried to whack me. So it just makes sense, you know? W why am I telling you this? Of course I'm gonna fight mobs if they try to attack me. I know that, you know that. Anyway, moving on. On day 71, I was about to give up my search until I stumbled across this area. Oh, it's another one of those guys. Do I wanna fight him? Do you guys actually really hurt or no? Oh, no, no, I stop it, Phantom. Oh, okay, that's not that bad. Okay, good. Phantom? Arr. Oh, 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 okay. Okay, never mind. Oh, no, 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 never mind. Oh my gosh. Okay, um... This isn't good. <sighs> Phantoms! I can't, I can't die, my Phantom. Alright, where'd you go now? Come on. I'm gonna take you down. I don't even care. It's gotta be smart. What are you, what are you hitting? Oh! Oh! Oh my gosh! S stop! Why you hit me so quick? Ow. Okay, 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 okay. Alright. Ah. I shouldn't be doing this. Okay, no, I gotta take him down. How many hits do you take? Oh my gosh. I need to rethink this plan. Where you going? Don't run. Get back here. Where'd you go? You're running? I'm gonna find ya. Yeah, I guess you ran away, you got scared. Whatever. I win. Yep. Big ol' scaredy pants. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, 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 wait. Is that, is that it? That's gotta be the structure. That's gotta be the structure. 
There it was, in all its glory. Uh, what is this thing again? Oh wait, yes, right. So these structures were supposedly the homes of the wardens. Not sure why they don't live here anymore, but maybe it's because of the phantoms. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure it's because of the phantoms. I mean, come on, they're annoying. And and all the water, that, that's, gotta, that's gotta be a pain too to deal with, you know? Look at that, all kinds of stuff here. We've got stone, deep slate. Oh, do they, do these actually work? Phantoms, don't mess this up for me. Well, here, we're gonna check. Let's just see. No, they, they, they're fine, good, perfect. Oh, books, nice. Oh, and obsidian, all right. I'll take some enchanting books, that's good. Oh, emeralds and diamonds, nice. This is great. Oh my gosh, look at that. Look at that. All right, we got, oh, we got more up here. Cool, okay, okay, let's go. What do we got, what do we got? Warden Carapace? What's that? Oh, books. Oh my gosh, more. Hey! Stop. There. Serves you right. Stay down there. Get. Get out of here. Oh, more obsidian. Good, good, good. I need more obsidian because I need to go to the nether. I need ancient debris. I don't think I can get ancient debris here. Oh, string. I can make a bow. Ah! What is that? Oh my gosh, that's a stalker. No. No! Why? Why did he spawn? He just came out of the ground! Alright, where you at? Where you at? Oh! What? What? Oh, that's one of those worms. Okay, okay, okay. Um, yeah. I don't know what to do. He's right there. He's coming. He is coming. Maybe. Maybe not. Go away! I spent like three days looking for this! I just want to loot it! Oh my gosh, you're freaky dude, go away! Okay, listen. Wanna play? We'll play. Come on. Let's go. Ow. Oh, what? What? What's? What's hitting me in the water? What is going on? Uh, something hurting you? What's going on? Why are you getting damaged? Oh my gosh, look at all- What did- What did you just pop out? You are very, very weird, my friend. I have no idea what is going on! Okay, um, so he was getting damaged in the water, so maybe I can just whack him a couple times, maybe? Worms! You need to chill. Oh my gosh, come on. Oh, no! Alright, just a couple whacks. That's all I want. Just a couple whacks. Oh, 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 oh my gosh! Did you see that? If I didn't have armor on, I, I would have been dead. I would have been dead! Um... New plan. Let's uh, let's go away here for a second and uh, let's let's uh, try to figure this out. I wasn't sure what I was gonna do at this point. Obviously, I didn't want to try and take him head on because we all know how that would work out. So since my inventory was full of loot, I decided to find a nice safe spot for the moment and start smelting all the raw iron that I had to free up space and give me enough time to figure out a plan. You know. The next day I had a plan. It wasn't a good one, but at least I had something. I don't know if I can take this stalker out to be honest, but since this stalker was outside, away from the temple, in the water, there's a good chance for me to go around and enter the temple from behind, without alerting him. Oh my gosh, you guys. I'm trying to do something. Alright, I'm gonna lose you in the water then. Hey! What? You guys shouldn't be able to get in the water! That's cheating! Ow. Okay, I'm just gonna ignore the phantoms. Just gonna keep going my way. I'm gonna go through the back. Oh my gosh, is he out there? He is out there. Look at him. Oh, don't be twitching. Why is he twitching? I don't get it. Okay, just keep looting. That's all I gotta do. Oh, okay, I, I meant to go in the water there, but sure. These must not work. Like, oh, okay, never mind. They definitely work. Oh, wow. There's a whole bottom part in this. There's a whole inside. Okay, I can get the- Oh, diamonds! Ha <laughs> ha! Nice! Okay, so there's a lot of chests, there's a lot of vases. Uh, that's not good! No! Oh my gosh! Go, 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 go! There's two stalkers now! There's two stalkers! Oh my gosh! Why can't this be easy? I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna leave. I'm just leaving. Just leaving for now. Well, now I got two stalkers on me. So I guess that thing on his back is a vase. And when you break a vase, there's a chance that one of those stalkers will spawn. So that's great. Not really. 
But here's the thing, there was a book that fell out of that vase and it broke and I really wanted to know what it was. But it's a huge risk. I could end up dying for a low enchanted book, but my curiosity is gonna kill me. I gotta go get it. Ow, ow. I, I don't even see them. C come here, come on. Oh my gosh, look at all the worms. Where's that book? Where's that book? Oh, it's right there, it's, right, it's still there, it's still there. I can get it, I can get it, I can get it. Come on, st stop, get over here, not your worms, you. Oh, this okay this is ridiculous no okay no 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 okay no no you know what i'm just i'm just gonna go right behind right behind it's gonna get it it's gonna grab it it's gonna grab it it's right there it's right there no 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 oh my gosh oh my gosh you no 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 kid stalkers come and go 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 oh my gosh it's not gonna work i'm gonna die i'm gonna die i'm gonna die oh my word okay 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 enough enough I'm just gonna dig out. I'm just gonna dig out. I'm just gonna dig out. Okay, never mind. I'm leaving. Ugh. They are so annoying. You know what? I'm going to the other side and I'm just gonna dig through. I'm gonna dig through and I'll be fine. All right, all right, all right. I got it. I got it. I got it. No, no. No, no. Get it. Get out. Get out. Okay. Okay. I got it. I got it. I got it. It's fine. Oh, get off me. What was it? Fire aspect. Okay. Okay. That was worth it. I just need a good bow now. I can actually make one. Oh my gosh. Okay, worms. I'm done. I'm done with you. Okay, I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm done. I'm just gonna, just gonna chill here for a minute. Collect my thoughts. Woo! Why can't anything be easy in this dimension? All I want to do is loot the place. That's it. I got a couple of obsidian from a chest and I needed more because I haven't come across any lava yet and this seems like the only place to get it. So I gotta loot it. All right. Okay, look, this is it. I have had enough. I am tired of being bullied by the local wildlife. I'm gonna march right in there and loot what I came to loot. The stalkers seem to get stuck in the water or at least it really slows them down. So I should be able to move around them fairly easy as long as these things don't get too annoying because they're, they're already annoying. Where is he? Still over there? Yeah, he's still there. Yeah, I see you. You know what? It doesn't matter. You know what? There are chests that I want to get to, but it's fine. I'll, I'll go to this one. Skulk transmitter? What's that? <gasps> An infinity bow. You are kidding me. This is going to change things. Ooh, obsidian. Look at this. Infinity. You know what that means? It means I can sit here and I can pelt you with arrows all day long. And there's nothing you can do. Well, I mean, you can do something, but you, you seem like you're stuck, so... Actually, you know what? I'm gonna stop hitting him. I wonder, will him and the warden fight each other? Huh. Where do I come up with these ideas? Why do I do this? They really don't ever benefit me. But I mean, it, it would be interesting. I, I, I gotta say that at least. Don't do it, Shadow. Don't do it. Don't. No. Oh, okay. No. Okay. Here we go. There we go. There we go. Here he comes. Here he comes. Let's just watch. Get him! No, don't look at me. Go get the stalker. Snip him out. No, no, not me! Oh my gosh, Warden. I didn't free you to fight me. Go take out that stalker. He's he's annoying. He's uh he's putting bugs all over your place. Yeah? Oh. Okay. Um not me. I wasn't part of the plan. Okay, you know what? Maybe I can get the warden to come over here where this guy is in the corner and maybe if they like bump into each other they might start fighting can i get the chest from here oh i can nice oh ow 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 no 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 okay ah they're coming in they're coming get out of here warden you suck oh my gosh did they not stop coming okay this wasn't a good idea i never said it was a good idea okay i was just curious you know Anyway, the warden didn't seem to care about the stalker, so there's that. Great. But I did notice that the warden wasn't fond of his pets, as the warden seemed to be yelling at them or something. Why don't you send out your echo beam? The same thing you send out at me all the time. Jeez. Since the warden was occupied with those worm things, I was able to continue pelting the stalker with arrows until his ultimate demise. Then I had another good idea. Can I kill the warden from here? Since he's occupied with the worms, maybe? Possibly? Can I? Oh, no. No, he's gonna shoot me. He's gonna shoot me! Yes, no! Am I good? Am I good? Okay, I, I really shouldn't try to kill the warden. I, I can't see it ending well. Yeah, you know what? Right now, I'm just gonna go take care of the other stalker, and then, uh, hopefully figure something out. Yeah. 
Okay, so now since the warden was free and wandering inside the temple, I figured I would take some time and apply some of these book enchants to my weapons. You know, give the warden some time to calm down and go away. Once that was done, I went over and finished off the other stalker. I guess I didn't go far away from the temple because the warden was still there. The next day, I decided to break some of this skulk stuff while waiting for the warden to go away. Plus, I needed the experience anyway. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why is this so fast? Are you telling me I could have been using a hoe the whole time? I can get so much experience now. This is crazy. Once the coast was clear, I was able to get back inside and looted the rest of the chests inside the temple. I couldn't believe the amount of diamonds in this place. And to think, I spent days looking underground when I could have just found one of these places. Well, sir. I might have accidentally broke another vase that accidentally spawned another stalker, but it was okay because I took him down pretty easily. Plus I needed more of these things if I wanted to create my warden armor. And with that, it was time for me to head back. I spent the next couple days making my way back to the base, offloading my loot, tending to my crops, and I started getting my enchantment station together. I was pretty excited at this point to start enchanting. Things were looking good. Now, the next couple of days were a bit of a drag, as I needed more books, which required a lot of work collecting materials. The worst part was grinding out these guys for their flesh, until I had enough to make the amount of leather that I required. After that, I was just waiting around to dry out the paper. But it was all good though, because at the end of day 83, I was able to complete my enchanting station. Right. Awesome. I didn't think it was going to take this long to start enchanting, but here we are. On the plus side, getting experience was super easy now, since I figured out using a hoe is super efficient. But after a bit, it was time. Time to start looking for ancient debris. Now, I don't believe that there's any ancient debris in this dimension, and I can't waste time looking for it. So with the rest of the obsidian that I had, I built myself another portal and went searching for ancient debris. At the end of day 89, I finally mined the last piece of ancient debris that I needed. It was time to head back and start crafting that sacred warden armor. I was getting so close. I just hope this armor is enough to go against that primal warden. I really do. I spent the next day just getting my armor enchanted, grinding out the experience and crafting parts of the sacred warden armor. At the end of day 91, I finally completed the armor set. I was ready, well, equipment wise anyway. But since I had a few days left before facing that primal warden, I figured I'd go back to the temple and need one more of those warden care paces, or whatever they are, so I could make the sacred warden sword. And the only place I knew where to get one was back at that temple anyway. As the stalkers dropped them, I just hoped I left some vases to break because it'd be nice to have the complete set you know yeah that's what i thought it was a bit of a trek but it was so worth it i wish i found this earlier it would have made my time here a lot easier ah well either way it was time to bring forth another one of those stalkers okay so with the uh warden armor let's see how i can handle this guy if, if he ever if he responds how many vases are left ah oh, there we go there we go there we go okay 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 let's see how well i can actually handle him Oh, oh, he still hurts. What, what's the point of the armor? I think it only saved me like two hearts. I guess two hearts is better than nothing. That's, that's, uh, that kind of sucks. Oh, oh, chompers, where'd you come from? I haven't seen you guys in a while. Jeez. Good aim right there, eh? Look at that. Shot that worm like it was nothing. I don't know what is hitting me. The worms are so far away. Oh, another one. Okay, good. I'm good. I'm good at shooting arrows. All right, let's finish this. Let's just hope he dropped one of those warden care paces or whatever they are. All right, let's let's uh, let's make that sword. Let's do it. I'll have a full set. Okay, just gonna make one of these things. Uh, like this, maybe? Yep, there it is. Okay, got that. And then, watch this. Put the netherite sword in, and then this reinforced thing, and boom! Warden sword. Look at that, look at that, look at that! I got the whole thing now! Look at me! Now I'm good. Here we go. I'm going to wake the warden. Because why not? I want to fight him. This is a big open space, I think I can do it. Come on, warden. I got a couple days to burn. It's gonna take me about two days to get back, but else I gotta. Whoa! No! 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 Oh gosh! Oh gosh! Oh gosh! I 
I did not expect that. I did not expect that. Well, don't worry, Warden. I see you. Get in the water. Come on. It's your own fault you went in the water. He's gonna run at me. You watch. He's gonna start running. He's gonna start running. Oh, I hear him, I hear him. Oh, I hear him. Don't think so, Buster. something very dangerous just go shadow just dig oh my gosh what am i doing he's gonna get here he's gonna get here go oh yes here we're out we're out we're out come on there slow poke can you even get through one by two i don't even know doesn't look like it oh are you stuck I'm sorry. You know what? I feel like I'm cheesing you. I really do. But if I go down there, it's a straight shot to him. I don't want to do that. You know what? Let's do it. Oh, that's bad. Not good. Not good. Not good. That hit me hard. I'm gonna go around. Is he here? Is he here? Oh! Oh my gosh! Nope! I know I don't want to cheese him, but I can't even get near him. There's gotta be a way to reflect that, right? Nope. I don't need you guys. Why is there so many of you? Look, I'm trying to fight the warden. Away. No, come this way. Why? You gotta do that. You know what? Let's make a boat. Okay. Okay. Can I still swing in this? Oh, yeah, I can. Go away, would ya? I'm fighting the warden in a boat, okay? I just don't know. If he can still shoot. Or, I mean, I don't know if he can still hit me. Look! No. No. Oh! What? <laughs> what? I can't believe that worked! He didn't... He didn't... Ooh, a heart. He didn't, um... He didn't blast me. He hit me, which was... Good enough, I guess, but I thought he was gonna sonic boom me, but he didn't. Mate, does the boat change that? I wonder. Ah, anyway, I gotta I gotta get back. I gotta I gotta get Timothy. We gotta go kill the primal warden. And uh yeah, we gotta we gotta do all that. Okay. I can't believe I just killed the warden. Wow, I thought I was gonna die there. Uh not gonna lie. Alright. Let's go. Okay. See, I told you. You know what a really good reason is for placing crafting tables down? Is that you find your way back pretty easy. Or at least you have a marker, right? Go all over the place. Need to build a better staircase, but you know what? I'm leaving this place, okay? I'm leaving. Not coming back. Get out of my house, please. You're not welcome. Ugh. Oh, really? Whatever, I'm leaving, I'm leaving. Timothy, where you at? I'm going back. Oh, there you are. Back we go, all right? gonna fight that primal warden buddy we're gonna we're gonna go back home sick of this place but we'll lock the door just in case you know we, we don't kill them we have to stay here right okay okay whatever whatever we're going let's go okay buddy um we are close pretty sure um pretty sure we're up here watch this i'm gonna actually use this whoa that didn't take me high <laughs> supposed to like throw me up here what a rip off that was okay oh there it is there it is, Timothy. Watch your step, buddy. Right on the edge. Are you ready? All right, let's do this. Let's do this. Okay, 
Where is he? I gotta be careful because the warden's in here too. And I don't really want to fight him again if I don't have to. Oh my gosh, I don't know what to do. I think Timothy's setting them off. All right, where is it? Where are ya? Is he here? Oh, yeah, he's here. Oh, he's right there. He is right there. And there are warden spawners all over the place. Oh, no. Hey. Ow. Oh, he hurts. No, no, no. No, no. I'm okay. Whoa. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Everything careful, buddy. Oh my gosh. Okay, um, new plan. No. We do not want the warden here. No, thank you. Right here, buddy. Come on. Oh my gosh, he's fast. Oh no. Oh no. That's not good. Oh my gosh, he hits hard. Yeah? You can't get over here, can ya? I guess you can go up here. Yeah, you can't go up here. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh! Listen! This guy is scary. Oh, no. Oh, jeez, no. No. No, no, I was gonna take advantage of the apple, it didn't work. Ah! Oh my gosh, this is, no! 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 We got the warden too! Come on! I already fought him once, I'm not fighting him again. How many wardens can actually spawn? I just want to know if if I can I get rid of them? Well, he's already out. I've never tried this before. Just gotta make sure I don't get in their way. Where is the warden stuff? Okay, he's there. Don't know where he's looking. I'm not over there, buddy. Okay, okay. So he just comes to a different spot then? Ooh. No, there's more than one. There is more than one. So that means I got possibly three wardens? Maybe two? And a primal warden. What am I doing? There's another one over here. If I can break a few of these in one area and drag him over here, I might have a chance. Possibly. No warden, go away. I want none. Does he not burn? Okay, they changed that. My question is, where's Timothy? He's probably stuck somewhere. Hiding. Ooh, let's go in here for a minute. So this stuff calms down. Yeah, that's one gone. Come on now, just to spawn. Timothy, where are you, buddy? Oh, they're probably on the other side of that. I, I ran pretty far. I hope he's alright. Pride and Warden's gotta go down. I can't leave Timothy. And I gotta take him down. I can't leave him. Alright, good. Good. We can continue.
Where are you, Primal Warden? There he is. Does he see me? Uh, I think he sees me. Okay, I get one good hit on him. Get run, run, run. No, no, no. Get it, get it, get it. Go, 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 go. Oh my gosh, he's coming. Okay, 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 okay. Just block and hit, block and hit. No run. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh, this is intense. I could just keep pelting him and hiding, but I don't want to. Just, uh, shh, shh, quiet, quiet. You're going to give up my position. I didn't need him. No. Run. No. Okay. Okay. I could use my arrow and cheese him, but I don't want to. I'll hit him a couple times, maybe. You know, soften him up a little bit. Oh, zombie! Ow. I'm not getting close enough. Climbing? Oh, he's climbing. Oh, he... Where are you going? Okay, run, 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 run. Uh. My heart is pumping. Timothy, where are you, buddy? There. What are you doing? Come on, we gotta get him. He's got to be almost dead. I hit him like 10 times. Maybe 20. Okay, maybe 4. Okay, alright. Alright. Block, and then hit. And then run. Careful, buddy. Oh, I'm in the water. No, get out of the water. Get out of the water. Get him, Timothy! Come on, buddy, let's get him! Get him! Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Come on, Timothy, hit him. Let's get him together. Oh. He's coming. Oh, he's coming. Go down. We've had enough. Oh no. How much life do you have? Oh. Come on, you. Running low on a shield. What? Did I? I took him out. Timothy, where are you at? Buddy, we took him down. That's crazy. We did it, buddy. We did it. We can go home. Wait, what? What's that, Timothy? They should subscribe. Yeah, I think they should. It lets us continue our adventures, doesn't it, buddy? It all helps out. But for now, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. I'm done with this place. So done.